to my channel and today I'm going to be doing a quick um simple natural hair ponytail um obviously you can see my hair is like thick and blown out what I'm going to do is just going to slick it up real nice I'm going to add some braid hair in and I'm just going to do a long braid down to the side so um I won't talk your head off I just go ahead and get started I just got um one bag of braid hair in one B, but I do have an extra in case I'm needing to use it. Um, hopefully, only I will have to use one bag. So I have this, and then just my regular edge control, um, go down and gel, and things like that. So let's go ahead and get started. <laughs>
result um definitely let me know what you guys think of this now let me tell you it honestly took me a long time only because i didn't i feel like i didn't think everything through um i did remember originally i said i was going to use one pack of hair but i did use two um because once i started the braid of course this is like my real hair my real hair probably stops about in here and so i felt that the braid was getting too thin so i kind of wanted to look natural looking you know like you wanted to look thick kind of throughout the braid so that's when i had to go in and open the other package and then feed the hair in as i was braiding now that is really what took me a long time because i had to do it in the middle of my video and i wasn't prepared because i would have if i was originally going to use it i would have went ahead and you know um pulled them apart spaced it how i wanted so that's what really took me a long time the process is if i would have already had this in my head prior to starting the video then i don't think it would have took me a long time so probably overall i mean a slick and everything probably 15 20 minutes and then maybe add like another minute to another five minutes to just go boil your water and curl your ends but it's actually not a hard braid at all it's just the fact of um blending your own hair with the braid now i also did that little um scrunchy hair technique only because i wanted it to kind of look like it was coming from my head so once i wrapped the well, it's actually a headband because scrunchies don't fit on my hair but at, once i wrapped it around i feel like it looks so much more natural looking you see what i'm saying like as it's coming out of my actual ponytail i thought that was really neat of course my hair is a little more frizzy up here but you honestly really cannot tell I mean, because it's braid hair, and braid hair is already nappy as it is, and so I felt like it would blend fairly well, which it actually did, but I'm thinking I may do another one and use Marley hair because I know that will be amazing because Marley hair is really, really nappy. So I may go ahead and do that one, but for the first time, I feel like this one turned out okay. So, um, like I said, it really didn't take me a long time. I went in and kind of found the piece of hair that was sticking out, and I curled this one. I added my little jewelry, which I think I have to go buy some bigger ones because these are smaller ones, and they're not, they're staying, but I feel like they'll fall out. So I need to go get some, like, bigger size ones. And then I always try to go ahead and incorporate this because I love this. Um, I don't know why I got it from the Dollar Tree in the garden section. They also have other colors. I had a, I have a red one somewhere. They have green, they have purple. It was only a dollar. I just incorporated this in here. Um, and I made it look funky because I didn't want it just a circle, not a circle, like a little curl. I, I kind of like the little junky look to it. And then I just went in and of course dipped these in hot water and, um, they curled up. So this was definitely a fun little braid and it actually looks very natural looking. Um, with me tugging on my hair a lot, I did loosen up my ponytail. So I did have to go back and hair pin it, but it still looks pretty good. If you ask me, of course, I always have to go in and do my, lay my edges as well. And I just pulled out a little curly piece over here because my ponytail is sitting on this side. So I'm going to go ahead and just kind of do a close up on it and show you the braid. I'm going to try to go long as possible. So, um, definitely let me know what you guys think on this. Like, comment, subscribe. Follow my other social medias. Follow me on Instagram, Laysassy7. And follow me on Snapchat, Laysassy. Thank you guys for watching.